Cluster headaches are a rare neurological disorder characterized by a painful headache at repeated intervals. As its name indicates, it is a group of frequent and recurrent series of headaches. A single attack may last from days to months and may prolong into a year. The duration of the attack is from 15 minutes to 3 hours. Almost 1 out of 1,000 people suffer from this disease. The first incidence is usually between 20 and 40 years. Men are 4 more times vulnerable to cluster headaches than women. Cluster headaches are also known as suicide headaches. From here, you can probably estimate the severity of its nature. People suffering from this condition often think about suicide. According to a survey, 55% of victims stated that they have thought about suicide while experiencing cluster headaches. Along with that 55%, 20% of affected individuals have lost their jobs due to cluster headaches. Restlessness is a prevalent symptom of cluster headaches. Other symptoms are swelled eyes, pupil constriction, runny nose, watery eyes, redness, and swelling of face. Droopy eyelids, sweating, feelings of piercing, burning, and squeezing. Secondary signs are sensitivity towards light and noise, depression, anxiety, confusion, lack of planned or organized thoughts, agitation, and aggressiveness. People often confuse cluster headaches with migraines, but both are different. In cluster headaches, a person bears intense pain along one side of the face. Most of the time, cluster headaches are predominant in the right side of your face. It is a genetic disorder. It comprises of regular and unpredictable onset of sudden pains. You may get them at the same time and month every year. That's why we call them seasonal. People tend to have one to two attacks of cluster headaches daily, but the frequency of attacks may increase up to eight times per day if left untreated. The exact cause behind this headache is unknown, but it is believed to be associated with cardiac activities of the body repeated after 24 hours. You see, the hypothalamus is responsible in producing these rhythmic activities. The hypothalamus gives signals to the nerve pathway. These signals affect the trigeminal nerve, which induces the feeling of burning and severe pain. Cluster headaches are also known as an alarm clock headache due to their nature. There is no periodicity in regularity, but a person may have them at precise times of the day or night. Measuring factors like frequency, duration, and severity are not the same for every individual. An individual may suffer from episodic or chronic cluster headaches based on the length and frequency of the attack. Episodic cluster headaches comprise 85 to 90% of total cases while chronic is 10 to 15% of total reported cases. The episodic condition lasts about a week, and the pain-free duration is higher than three months, while chronic conditions last for months and an even greater than a year, but the pain-free period is less than three months. Some factors that can trigger cluster headaches are alcohol, tobacco, and smoking. The elements do not initiate a cluster headache, but they can intensify the ongoing pains. Individuals should go for lifestyle modifications like an 8-hour sleep cycle, following a routine schedule, and avoiding triggering factors. We can treat acute cluster headaches with a surplus supply of oxygen and tryptans. In severe cases, nerve stimulation surgery is probably the last option. The cluster headache is often undiagnosed or misdiagnosed. People visit their ENT doctor as these parts are most affected. A person should be able to recall for their doctor the onset timing and duration for proper diagnosis. Isolation and social withdrawal are consequences faced by affected individuals.